Toy Insanity says, Jeff, were you ever a raver? Uh, I've been into some raves. Uh, I've been uh, back in my young adult uh, years where I was working at a grocery store and going to college. I went maybe four or five times in after party type of stuff. Uh, in fact, uh, I went. Uh, it. I went to a rave. Uh, <laughs> I went to a rave relatively recently, uh, about a year ago. Um, but that was just. I, I didn't stay for long. I just. Me and Mama JF, we we went there. We watched the music and we we listened to the music and we stood there for I think maybe two hours, three hours, and then we we left. It was just to see what was happening, and it was a particularly... It was a free uh, day, so it was free to enter. Mama JF says, Lol, you remember I bring you once. Yeah, exactly. Mama JF brought me to this. It was in the... Like, it, at the middle of a forest, you had to drive through the woods for two or three hours uh two or three hours uh i mean we drove we drove a total of one or two hours to get there but then within the wood part you had to drive about 10 minutes 10 minutes through the jungle essentially and at the middle of this forest was this bunch of people with batteries apparently running the music on batteries and uh they they had little uh, symbols like masks of th- there were there were flashing lights of fishes and different icons being uh, presented and then there was a dj and mama jf always too much onto the party you know she was annoying the the dj i had to i had to contain her she was trying to to take the earphones of the t- from the table of the DJ and trying to listen to it, and I was like, "Let the earphones there." <coughs> but yeah, uh, Mama said, "Mama JF says, lol, JF was like, okay, we go away now." <laughs> yes, Mama JF was trying to socialize with everyone, and she was like. Can I dance with you? Like there was this other girl and she was dancing with this other girl and it was kind of awkward. Mama Jeff wanting to be in that trance mode and stuff. And then she was like, do you have a cigarette? And she was giving her a cigarette and, um, and the girl looked at me and then looked at Mama Jeff and said, you have your, you have your bodyguard angel or something. She said, you have your protecting angel. <laughs> because there I was, super serious with my gray shirt. Everyone around me uh, on this uh, on this trance, uh, I'm dancing. Oh, and, and I was like, just protecting Mama Jeff from herself, standing behind her saying, perhaps we should go now. <laughs> Mama JF says, lol, really? Oh my god, I don't even remember, lol. Uh, well, uh, Mama JF doesn't remember, but you know, there I was. Uh, Mama JF was trying to dance onto the speakers at some point, And I was like, this is extremely dangerous. These speakers are extremely high. And there Mama JF, uh, completely drunk, uh, was just dancing on the speaker. So I was just right below her, making sure that if she falls, I can catch her. Uh, Nicholas, so yeah, the, yes, I've been to raves, but not in a, in a super participative manner. Uh, I've been mostly there. Um, I've been mostly there to uh, listen to the music and then leave. Mama JF is here. How are you doing? What? I did that. Yeah, you did that. 
I don't even remember. You don't remember. Ah, it was for the Saint Jean, Saint Jean Baptiste. Oh yes, it was the twenty fourth of June, the national celebration of Quebec. Oh my God, it's so hard to find. Like, they always do the little thing that like, you need to find this, uh, like a treasure. It was it. yeah, it was very hard to find because we were like, okay, there's two and three to this forest. Which one it it is it? And then we were waiting for other people. Other cars were coming in and they were as confused as us. It was like, do I drive in this mud pile or do I drive in this mud pile? Yeah, but we go again soon. No, we yeah. never go back I to this. I don't know if they do it like still, huh, with all this. They probably do it. I mean, it was illegal to begin with, right? <laughs> so, I mean, illegal in the sense that... Um, in the sense that I don't know that they have the authorization to be on these lands. I don't know how it works. Uh, but I don't know that going there is illegal. But perhaps the owner of this by running this may be doing illegal things. We need to find one in the North Pole. In the North Pole? <laughs> All right. Well, we'll see if that exists. I, I think that thankfully so, it doesn't exist. Mm -hmm. So it won't be a problem. But yeah, with COVID, I guess that they, they are just being targeted more for crackdowns. Uh, but they were targeted for crackdowns before. Bear Trap says, it says that JF is not as square as we thought. He's a hippie. Love ya, duck. Laughing my ass off. Um, yeah, I'm not a hippie. If, if you were at this rave you would have seen me stand out from the crowd as non-hippie, particularly non-hippie. <laughs> I was surrounded by hippies, but I'm not a hippie. Just that Nara says, don't admit illegality here on YouTube, JF. No, I mean, certainly I'm not saying that we, because I was absolutely sober, by the way, when I drove there. Uh, so I didn't do, and Mama JF didn't do anything illegal, but in these places, there are certain actions that are illegal, and it, it happens, unfortunately. Uh, 